Well, hello there, everyone. Welcome to another reading from Hell for You. My name is Michelle Rell. Are you ready to read, sing, and talk? I know you are. That means you are well today, as Miss Cheryl always hope you are. So, how about we start off by singing our hello song? Hello everyone, how are you? How are you? How are you? Hello everyone, how are you? How are you today? Hello everyone, clap your hand, clap your hand, clap your hand. Hello everyone, clap your hand, clap your hands today. Hello everyone, stamp your feet. Stamp your feet, stamp your feet. Hello, everyone, stamp your feet, stamp your feet today. Good job! You know the song so well now. So, how about we sing our second song? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Are you ready? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, then you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. Wow, you are all ready for our story today. Well, Miss Cheryl got up this morning and also I was looking all dreary. It's a beautiful day. But it reminded her of a winter day. So Miss Cheryl looked through her books of tricks until she found a book about snow, snow dance. Now, how many of you know the four season in America? Okay, some of you got it right, and that's important. But it's also important for us all to learn the four seasons. So right now we are in the season of spring. And after spring comes summer. After summer comes fall or autumn. And after autumn comes winter. So we just finished winter and we are in the spring season. Now, in some other countries, we celebrate two seasons. It's called the wet season and the dry season. So, in the wet season, we have hurricanes and lots of rain. Now, we don't have rain every single day, just like you don't have snow in America every single day in winter. But, we have lots of rain for the food to grow. And also, we have the dry season. So, in the dry season, we hardly have, there is hardly ever any rain. It's hot out all day, and it's hot, hot. But then sometimes rain falls, because again, we need rain to do so many things. We need water. So, Let's read this story about Snow Day and see what happens. And this one is Snow Day by Richard Scarry. Huckle had a sled. It is new. It is red. Bump, bump, oops. Do not sled in here, Huckle. Where do you think Huckle was sledding? That's right, in the house. 
Haka goes up a hill, up, up, up. He sleds down, down, down. Bump, bump, oops, a sled needs snow. A sled needs snow to go. Haka goes to bed, he sleeps on the sled. Come on, snow, snow, come on. Haka has a dream. He dreams of snow. Haka wakes up. He has an idea. Time to make snow. Haka gets ice. Loli gets a wagon. Ella and Molly gets, get eyes. Atta and Skip get eyes. Wow, that is a lot of eyes. They take the eyes, they go to a hill. They put the eyes on the hill. Time to sled. Do you think that's going to work? No? Yes? You don't know? Well, let's see. Haka goes first. His friends push. The ice cracks. The sled tips. They all fall. Oh, no. So what do you think just happened? Well, let's read some more. They do a dance, a dance for snow. Step left, step right. Jump high, jump low. Come on, snow. Come on, snow. They jump. They spin. They all fall down. Come on, snow. We need you, snow. Down comes one flake. Ah, uh, down come some more. See the snow? Snow! Time to sled, zoom, zoom, down the hill. Thank you, snow. Thank you, snow dad. Hooray for snow. D -M. Did we like that story? Don't we like a story with a good ending when something good happens? Well, it was supposed to rain here today. It's not raining. But whether it snows or it rains, as Cheryl always thinks, it's a beautiful day. Now, can you... Play along with me a little. Can we go fast, 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 fast? Fast, 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 fast. Now can we go slow, 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 slow? Well, the opposite of fast is slow. So, Huckle went fast, 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 fast. And then he went slow, 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 slow. Have you been good today? I know you all have been good. The opposite of good is bad. And I know not one of you have been bad today. And that makes me really, really happy. Now, let's do one more opposite. Have you been sad today? You happy? Did you know that's the opposite of sad? Being happy? I'm so happy you are all happy. So now you know what opposites are. That's good for you and your vocabulary. So let's sing our closing song. The song we usually sing before we close. And Miss Cheryl is going to do something a little bit different today. We opened with, if you're happy and you know it, 
And because you are happy, we're going to close with if you're happy and you know it again. Ready? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. Did you have fun today? Did you learn what opposites are? Do you think you'll remember and keep on practicing? Then the Cheryl hope you do. So until our next story time, it's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. See you next time for another story time from Health for Youth. Bye.